Hey everyone, I uh, just want to give a gentle reminder about Dr. Stan and Joan DeCoven's visit as it relates to ETC uh, students and people involved with ETC. Uh, obviously we've got a wonderful day of counselling seminar on Saturday the 26th of August so if you've not registered for that and if you're able to come I highly recommend you doing that because you're going to knock over videos and the sessions for that subject on Christian counselling. And also on the Wednesday night, the 30th, there's an actual meet and greet and a fellowship time with Dr. Stan and Joan with all our ET students, ETC students and staff. So if you can get along, you need to register for that. So you'll see all the information on the church website and in relation to ETC, we'll send you out an email and you can uh, just uh, uh, connect through that. Now, here I am at the Life Christian Centre and uh, obviously on the some of the work site where our building is being extended, and what you can see here, obviously, the slab's gone down this past week. But I just wanted to point out the depth of that slab. Now, that's just the footing side of it. So along here, they have footings. And below the ground, it goes down quite a long way. And, of course, then the slab sits on top of that. But in that slab, there's also steel to reinforce the foundation. And I just want to talk about foundations because I believe that ETC studies helps to lay a great foundation in people's lives so you can then build a fantastic building on top of it. So studying the Word of God is so important and it brings to mind 2 Timothy chapter 2 verse 15. It says, study to show yourself approved to God, a worker that rightly divides his word. And so I just want to encourage you with your studies. Block in time each week to do the study and uh, knock over a book or two over the next couple of months. God bless you. Hope to see you with Dr. Stan and Joan DeCoven's um, itinerary and the events that we have. Uh, so uh, God bless you. Hope you have a great day. It's a bit rainy here, but I've uh, got this in between the rain. God bless you.